Welcome back. We have a very good guest that comes on every, whenever he wants, I guess. John Burnside is here from hey, North John. Arkansas Regional Medical Center. Well, you know, I'm not here to talk about the colorectal screening that we're doing right now, but <laughs> yeah, that's but you are doing. Yeah. We've had some good conversations about those over the years, and, uh -huh. uh, but we are doing that. <laughs> if right we can now. make it interesting, we will. We will. <laughs> and uh, I really, I, I wanted to do a colorectal screening here on screen on TV, um, but you've not said that you'd be willing to do that, and so. <laughs> we'll save Many of our we'll, other guests we'll, want to no, volunteer. Anybody, we'll, but we'll, we'll save it for the prostate screening later in the year, and I'll come back. And we'll, I think we should do that live. <laughs> there we go. Okay. There we go. No, I, I'm actually I guess here, I'm up for anything. <laughs> we're here to talk about the uh, triple crown He's running. He's red. <laughs> he is red. So. <laughs> I usually don't get uh, blindsided, but uh, Burnside blindsided me. Well, I'm sorry about that. <laughs> no, you're... I'm glad, uh, I'm glad that we could blindside you. Blindside you so. Here's something that you can be involved in, though, right? It is. It is, and there's no colorectal prostate involved in this 5K Can we move all, on so. from the scoping right. and all that? A couple of years ago, uh, North Arkansas Regional Medical Center started a 5K. When I say mm -hmm. couple, it's more like 30, Many. 35 years ago. They started a 5K, and it's been very successful mm -hmm. for these 30-plus mm -hmm. years. Uh, we have over 600 people participate in our 5K, either run, walk, or volunteer. And a couple of years ago, I said, hey, wouldn't it be fun if we involve some of these other 5Ks, some of them that pop up and leave, and some of them that uh, have died and all those kind of things, get the better ones involved and form a triple crown of running. It could have been a quadruple crown, but it was there were three races mm -hmm. that I said, hey, these races have kind of stood the test of time. They mm -hmm. kind of stand out. They're kind of different. Mm -hmm. And wouldn't it be fun to involve all three of those? Uh, leave our separate identities, but have this common um, race theme. And so mm -hmm. uh, I have uh, contacted these other two races, one of them being the North Arkansas College Pioneer Challenge and the other one, the Race for Grace. They're very uniquely different. Mm -hmm. Ours mm -hmm. is uh, part of Crawdad Days, Saturday, May 17th, 8 o'clock. We run around Lake, beautiful Lake Harrison. Uh, the North Arkansas College Pioneer Challenge uh, is a cross-country type mm -hmm. race out on their cross-country course. Very fun, very very challenging race. Uh, if you've ever done it, it, it will it'll leave you breathing, breathing pretty heavy. And then the final one is a night race, which they give you glow-in-the-dark bracelets, and they run from mm -hmm. the downtown right in front of the Lyric and finish on the other side of the square, but they run around the junior high parts of Lake Harrison. Three very unique races, mm -hmm. and we uh, want to remain, you know, our own identities. Mm -hmm. uh, but we said if you participate in all three of those, then we could uh, possibly give you a prize. And we decided to develop a T-shirt uh, with our Triple Crown logo on it. Mm -hmm. And uh, I think it's going to be fun for people who are looking to become more physically active. Yeah, Harrison's always got, um, you know, thoughts about being a more healthy community right. and those type things. And I was thinking, how can we can, can carry that on? And people respond real well to the 5Ks around here. If you're an avid runner, or not even an avid runner, just somebody sure. walker is, is, is fine too. We have as many walkers as we do runners in ours. And uh, this year ours is kind of, we talked about this a little bit at break, it's based on our, it's a themed on the uh, popular television series, uh, The Walking Dead. And we call it The Walking Dead Tired. And people say, well, I don't, you know, I don't know anything about the show. You don't have to know anything about the show to participate. Yeah, yeah. I'm scared of zombies. We're not. They're, they're going to be friendly zombies. Yeah. Not friendly zombies give you a cup of water when you ask for one. And we're going to ask for those type of zombies to be on the course. And so <laughs> it'll be lots of fun. We've never done a theme before. I think going back and before Crawdad Days, I guess it was kind of themed. Yeah. Um, but you know, uh, but we've never done a theme. And we thought, let's do a theme. Mm -hmm. That would be fun, mm -hmm. something different. Mm -hmm. uh, we've always tried to add something. And we have one of the most successful 5Ks um, oh, lots in, of in the state lots of Arkansas. Of people, yeah. And uh, well, then we asked those 600 plus people just to walk on down and, and enjoy and wow. participate in Crawdad Days. Mm -hmm. So it'll be lots and of fun. And you don't have cool. to do it competitively. Oh, at gosh, all. no. You now, we, we obviously have prizes for first, second, third in each age division. We give some very unique medals. Um, unlike a lot of races, we really we invest every penny back into our race. So we're able to give <clears throat> these fantastic prizes. Mm -hmm. And. Uh, so it is one of the best 5Ks. It is, it's equivalent to running you know, uh, a half marathon or something mm -hmm. in the mm -hmm. amount of people that are involved and the uh, excitement that's there yeah. and the prizes. Yeah. So, do the, you happen, I'm sorry, but do you happen to know the dates of the other I, I can tell you races? that one of them's in October. 
Okay. And the other one is in November, and okay. I would like to come back or and sure. have them come back and talk yeah. about their race at that time. Just but, so people kind of have a, a time span. Then. But obviously, to get that shirt, which is everybody's going to want, it's going to be a pretty cool looking shirt. Uh, it's going to be something you need to participate in all three, and so we encourage people to jump in now. And now get I have a question: When they yes. sign up for one, can they sign up? For all three? They can, or how does, because we are work? wanting to remain separate. And so okay. uh, everybody's funds will go something different. And when North Arkansas College comes on, they can talk about how they use okay. the money that they raise. And when uh, the Race for Grace, which is has a ranch, they have a ranch down in mm -hmm. Belfont area, mm -hmm. uh, Everton area, uh, for to bring kids in there. Yeah. And they do those type of things. They use their funds for that. And they yeah. also sponsor some cancer patients for Christmas uh, That's a really Christmas neat place also. to go. They do horse painting. The horse painting. Oh, I, I, I have love done that. that. I love that. Have you, been, have you seen the fainting goats? Oh, right next to them. Yeah, yeah. that is hilarious. <laughs> the 18 wheelers will come down hog, the goats faint. <laughs> Uh, they anyway. fall over. So oh, that's funny. That is fun. <laughs> it is. They, they they do a great job. And so those three distinct races, we think, add to the overall mm -hmm. thought that Harrison is a great place to come and exercise, be healthy, and that's kind of a thing. So, for okay. for the um, for the first race registration, you can get it online. You you can go to of course the, the that easiest way to do that is call four one four forty four. 40. So it's 4440, 414-4440. And uh, they'll give you a, mail you a registration form. Oh, okay. You can go online, go to the Crawdad Days. I yeah. think there's a link. Yeah. The hospital uh, website also has a link. Mm -hmm. So, but it's a, it's a pretty inexpensive way. You get a t-shirt, get this cool Walking Dead tired t-shirt. Um, you get mm -hmm. a, um, we always try to give something else. So we're giving, this year we're doing a, a reusable tote, uh, <coughs> grocery tote. Uh, and that's 20 bucks. I yeah. Mean, that, mm -hmm. 20 bucks, come yeah. out, have a great time, walk around, crawl that days, get to get, get to see it in a blur, and then you can go back and enjoy it later. Right. Cool. So, cool. Lots wow. of fun. Thanks for coming by. We'll have you back to talk about those other two events later on in the season. I appreciate anything it. Anything you want to talk about, uh, uh, barring any kind of screenings? Uh, you know, I'll come back. I'd like to do the screening. We're gonna, I'll get with, with Ann. It's going to happen. We'll, we'll schedule that. Okay. Bend over, but no, it's going to okay. happen. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, John. Thank you. Appreciate it. Up next, you want to introduce who's up next? <laughs> we have Hannah Horton and we have Katie Tipton here. They are two of the members of the cast for Footloose. Stay with us. You're getting us. Oh, that's fine. Let me get